morning, good afternoon, good evening, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. Happy Sunday. It has been a hectic morning. Went to Zumba this morning and then I came home. I, you're in the background. Do you care? <laughs> Sissy's just like itching her eye in the background. I had to upload my vlog, so I was up at like, I literally got up at 7 a.m. this morning. My body was just like, up, oh, you've got things to do. So I made the thumbnail, we uploaded, I got up a reel, I got up an Instagram post. All content is up. It was supposed to go up yesterday because yesterday was Saturday. That's my upload day, but it just had to be delayed because I went and saw Zane's little sister's show last night. It was so good. Little Shop of Horrors. It was so cute. She uh, plays the flute for the Pit Orchestra. It was it was a really great show, actually, for a high school show. I was very, very impressed. Anyways, happy Sunday. We are headed out to Belmont Racetrack, to the horse track. One of my dad's favorite things to do. It's nostalgic to me because when I was a little girl, we used to go with my grandpa. We would always, like, bring sandwiches and just... It was We were, like, a family of the horse track. I don't know why, but we just were. So we're celebrating Father's Day a little bit early since my sister is here. She won't be here for actual Father's Day. So uh, we are getting ready to head over there. My parents went a little bit earlier this morning to like get a spot and stuff. And we just, you know, we're going to meet them there now. So it's a beautiful day outside. I just got ready so fast, but I'm not mad at it. I do need to redo my tan, but that's going to have to happen later tonight. I'm wearing my dress from Newly. Let me show you. Okay. Today is Sunday cleaning. That's going to happen later tonight. So please don't mind the disaster. We will do that together. This is my dress from Newly. Newly, I'll link it down below. I'll also link my Newly link. You can get $10 off. This isn't sponsored, but it's just like a code that like I get some credit, you get credit, you know? Why did the lighting go bad? We're in front of natural lighting. There we are. So I'm wearing the dress. I put on my Adidas sneakers. I wore no-show socks this time because I feel like sometimes socks can like ruin the vibe. And I don't know if it's like sometimes like dirt there, you know? I don't want to wear sandals. Plus, I need to redo my pedicure. So that's where we're at. Uh, Amazon purse and that's it. I just brushed my hair out for my leftover Dyson Airwrap. It is 120. And I wanted to leave by 1 30. We're also surprising my dad with ever Zane's stepdad They're like buddies. So he's gonna have so much fun He's gonna he's gonna be so happy that he has like a buddy to gamble with and bet on the horses with so he doesn't know he's coming But he knows that me Zane and my sister are going so Let's go. I'm gonna stop talking now. Let's have a beautiful Sunday guys. Look how bad my tanner is Tis the season of it just looking like alligator skin Some of you guys actually tagged me in a TikTok, and I was laughing because it was like tell me why I'd rather look like this than just my natural skin tone Like I'd rather look like I'm an alligator skin because at least I have a little bit of a tan But we're gonna get a real tan and get that real glow this season. I I believe in myself My face is definitely a little darker, but shh, no, one's gonna know. no one's gonna know just one of those days, but at least I'm still in a great silly goofy mood, so it's fine. I don't know what's wrong with me. I'm like high on something. Life. <laughs> I hope. I just want to tell you that. Okay, we have made it everyone. It is a gorgeous day outside. I'm actually so excited because it is Ever and Zane's first time here. So that makes it more exciting for me because I'm not a big gambler. But I know my dad loves it, obviously. But it's fun that we have people that it's their first experience. Belmont Park we go. <laughs> this is so nostalgic right here, this area. Oh my God. I'm so excited for you guys. You're gonna have so much fun. By the way, Jerry was supposed to come, but she wasn't feeling too hot, so she had to skip out on today, but that's okay. Here we go. Yay! There's dad. I see him. Where? Oh, I see him. You gotta surprise my dad. <laughs> Excuse me, sir, that's my seat. Hey! What are you at? What's up? How are you? How are you? Surprise! <laughs> <laughs> we brought you a, a gambling buddy. <laughs> this is the perfect day. Okay, Dad's happy now. We're gonna make a bet. A race is gonna start soon. I'm gonna bet on number three. Let's go. All right, guys, I bet on number three to win. You see, I just did it without even looking. People look at the stats of the horse or like yeah, the rat. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I didn't look at any of that. We just bet three. Maybe that's better. Five dollars on three. All right, race is about to start. We got a burger, chicken tenders, and fries. Oh, it's so exciting. I'm so hungry. And it's beautiful out. Oh, what a day to be alive. Wow. And we're right by the finish line. It's kind of everything right now. Come on! Ah! Three, 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 come on! Three, 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 come on! Three! No way! Come on, three. No way. <laughs> come on three. Go! Oh, no! That was so close! That was so close! Three was right behind two. Oh my god. Yo, three took the lead out of the Three, nowhere. you know what? He put in his best effort. I'll give him that. Yeah. Watching the horsies walk by. Aw, sweeties. Yeah. 
Well, that was so much fun. Zane and Ember loved it. We had a blast. I bet like literally only like 10 bucks and I lost it and I was like, eh, I've had enough. <laughs> but my dad had so much fun. He was so happy that Ever came. So it was a blast. But now we are home. We're taking a slight little break. Bella is hungry. Watch when Zane walks in. Watch. Are you waiting for daddy to feed you? You want dinner? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Tobbers is here. <laughs> Anyways, um, we're heading out to dinner in like less than an hour, like 45 minutes, I think. So we're gonna do speedy quick Sunday cleaning. So we don't have to do it later. And we're gonna go to a Father's Day dinner at 317 Main in Farmingdale, if we can get in, but I think we'll be fine. But it is a Sunday, so we'll see. Oh my God. The sun tires you out. I was up at seven today, so I'm getting exhausted. I can't wait to take an exfoliating shower later. Fresh tan. Yes, ma'am. We love that. Okay, let's Sunday clean. You. You look like a koala bear. So judgy. My friends say, girl, you better take care. Cause that man is trouble, you best be aware. And though it down, I know I might be headed for teardrops. Well, my parents are here to pick us up for dinner and all I got done was the dishes. We're gonna finish when we get back. Now that you got me started, I just can't stop. No, no. Happy Monday, everyone. I kind of stopped vlogging last night. We went out to eat and then I came home and finished my Sunday cleaning. And then I went in the shower, exfoliated my body so well. My back is peeling from my sunburn and my tan was so horrific. So I just really needed that like good exfoliation on my whole body. So I did that and then I knocked. It was so refreshing and nice. This morning I dropped off my sister at a nice 6.30 a.m. So she is actually already home she already landed so that's nice that's good she's safe and well and then i came back home and we launched gotta be good if you didn't watch the behind the scenes vlog go ahead and watch that i filmed me like putting it live and everything with natalie and it was just so exciting it was like such a surreal moment so i've just been like doing everything for that you know like watching the analytics i'm posting on instagram i'm doing q a on the stories and stuff like that so um that's kind of been taking up my whole day that's what i've been doing Oh, and I got on Tanner this morning, so I'm soaking. Yeah, that's the Monday. We have Zumba at 5.45, it is 2.17. I'm very excited for Zumba, it's gonna be fun. But for now, I'm just gonna keep getting some work stuff done. It's a typical Monday, so nothing too exciting here. Later tonight, Love Island starts, and that's one of my favorite reality TV shows. I love reality TV. So I'm debating on if I wanna pick something up or in honor of Gotta Be Good, try out a recipe because if you guys saw the vlog where I went to Natalie's friend's party, there was a taco salad that I want to recreate and I want to test that out so I can get it on the site soon. So I'm like, do I want to make that or do I want to celebrate and treat myself for launching the website and pick something delicious up and like come home and like eat TV on, eat TV? Eat food and watch TV on the couch. So we're debating on those plans for later. But anyways, yeah, it's just cool that now I can say, yeah guys, I'm testing out a recipe today because I would have to hide it. And I'd be like, uh, yep it's the next day and like meanwhile i was like cooking all day you know what i mean like i would have to like hide it so you guys didn't know what i was doing but in a lot of my vlogs i would like cook that day and just not show it it's very fun i feel like free now you guys i need to rinse off my tanner look at my from sweating <gasps> during zumba that's so bad <laughs> <laughs> whatever it's just one of those mondays it's fine um it is 8 17 zumba ended at 6 45 guess where i am in the parking lot <laughs> we launched gotta be good today so i did a q a on the instagram stories and it's so fun like i need to do those more i think i'm gonna do them more on my like Alyssa rose instagram too because it was just like fun i mean it's more fun answering about a project than myself to be honest so that's been fun i didn't film much more at home because zane had to film a youtube video so he was like in the middle of filming i didn't want to disturb him so we just went off to zumba i got another pair of sneakers so i want to show you they're basically the black ones that i have but they're white i don't care if you guys think i'm nerdy okay whatever just let me live my life let me love live laugh love my zumba okay 
Oh my god, but it was so much fun. I started to feel like weak and not good at the end and I think it's because I was up at 6.30. I never like took a nap or anything. I've just been going since 6.30. Probably should have eaten a little bit more food today, so I'm probably hungry and I probably should have drank more water. So I was also staring at a computer all day. Uh, so just all of those things combined, I didn't treat myself well today. And I just, at the end of the class, I was like, ooh, I do not feel very energized. I'm trying to get more hydrated and we're gonna make food when we get home. But it's been such a good launch. You guys are loving it and I'm so excited. And you guys are already making recipes and viewing stuff and it's just, it means the world to me. So I've decided that I'm gonna test a recipe tonight. So I'm gonna run to Lidl really quick and grab the ingredients for that. And then I'm also gonna stop by my parents real quick because my dad fixed my fan for me. I was like, DIY dad, Zane tried to put like WD-40 on it yesterday. He's like, this might be a project for DIY dad. So we gave it to him and he fixed it. Of course he did. We don't let a fan go to the curb, right? Stop at mom and dad's, go home. It's already 819, so I need to get this done quick because oh my god what about love island i don't even know how to watch that where do i watch that and what time does it start oh boy i'm gonna post on my story because you guys are helpful okay little then home little then home <laughs> Well, you guys, it got too late and now I'm tired. So I just took a nice shower and Zane made us sandwiches for dinner instead of me testing out, testing out a recipe. I'll do it this week though, but at least now I have the ingredients. So that's good. We're gonna start watching the new season of Stranger Things and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Happy Monday. Good morning, everyone. Happy Tuesday. It's already been a little bit of a day. We got the podcast done and I did some Instagram stuff for gotta be good and whatnot So you didn't miss too much. I just got myself all ready and put together for the day I wanted to say a huge shout out and thank you to today's sponsor, which is Majuri. I am so excited to share this with you guys. They sent over five pieces that I want to show you guys. I'm so grateful, thankful, blessed. First of all, the packaging is stunning. They come in these adorable reusable bags and then the packaging just looks like this. It flips right open. Also comes with a little jewelry polishing cloth and the jewelry comes in these adorable little pouches. So you guys know I love my gold, so let me show you what I got. First things first, the earrings that I'm wearing are called the Large Tube Hoops. They are just the most perfect, everyday wearable, simple hoop. It is so me. And then also right next to those, I am wearing the Bar Studs. Here they are up close. They're so simple and dainty. I feel like these would look good next to any earring that you wear them with. I love them. The next piece I am so obsessed with. This is the Pave Diamond Bar Bracelet. I mean, come on, you guys. Look at this bracelet. It is the most simple, dainty, beautiful thing I've ever seen. It is so my style. This would be so gorgeous stacked up with other bracelets as well. It fits amazing. It's so shiny. If you're looking for a nice, simple, dainty, everyday wearable bracelet, I am not going to take this off. So go treat yourself, ask for it for a graduation gift, whatever you got to do, you need this bracelet in your life. It is stunning. Oh my god, I'm obsessed. And then the next thing that I got is another pair of earrings. And yes, they come separately wrapped in their own individual little pouches. So these are called the thin oversized hoops. You guys know me and my hoops. I mean, I'm addicted. I have worn them since I think I came out of the womb. <laughs> No, actually, though. I love my chunky jewelry, but a thin classic hoop really, really gets me. So I'm really excited about these. These are such a staple. Belly, what do you think? You love the jewelry? She's hanging out with us. And then last but definitely not least, oh, love this too. This is called the Anchor Chain Anklet, and I have been wanting a nice quality, dainty ankle bracelet for so long, and this one is just perfect. I'm literally never going to take this off. Here it is up close. It is so simple and gorgeous. This would also look gorgeous stacked up with their other ankle bracelets. Oh, I love. I need to get some more ankle bracelets to stack them. The only reason that I'm not wearing this right now, because I totally would be, is it's a little bit big on me, so I do want to go get it sized because I'm not going to risk it falling off or getting caught on something and breaking. Absolutely not. We want to protect her at all costs. So I'm going to do that first before I wear this. The best part is every single piece that I just showed you are all 14 karat gold, meaning it won't oxidize or discolor, so you can wear it every day, everywhere, shower, workout, swim, whatever you got to do, you don't have to worry 
worry. So I think it's safe to say that all of these pieces are going to be my new everyday pieces. I'm obsessed. They're all so everyday wearable. They're dainty. They're beautiful. I'm just so happy right now. Also, how amazing is this? So currently 40% of Majuri's pieces are handcrafted by using certified recycled gold and they're committed to raising that to 70% in 2022. I think that's amazing. So I will have every piece that I just showed you guys linked right at the top of my description. Seriously, you guys, go check them out. I'm all about convenience and to me it is so worth it to get the high quality pieces that you don't have to worry about and they're gonna stay with you for years and years and years. It is so worth it. So go check it out and thank you again to Majuri for sponsoring this video. Alrighty guys, I just got a little bit more editing done. I need to keep editing. I need to upload today and I have Zoom about 7 p.m. But I'm hungry and I want to test the taco salad recipe, which I'm not going to show you guys step by step because you guys have to wait till it comes out on how to be good. But I'm going to start testing process because usually I test like about three times if I want to make any tweaks or anything like that. So this is like first draft. So I'm gonna put some of these clean dishes away. We've got a bunch of clean dishes and I'm gonna get that going. Pretty quick and easy recipe. So I'm excited. Now I get to tell you guys that I'm testing a recipe right now. Usually I just wouldn't film this at all, but we definitely need to make more room on this counter. So let's clean this off. I'm gonna have to have their salad later, unfortunately. Why? Cause I have to leave in 20 minutes. I probably will be done in 20 minutes. You reckon? I reckon. You want to help me out? Take out the beef? If you help me, I can get done even quicker. By the way, my little set here is from Lovely and Bush Boutique. It's like a little, what do you call this? I don't know. This is my recipe testing notebook. This is where all my like jotted notes go down while I'm cooking. So it's got all of them in there. Look at you. You know what ingredients to take out? Uh, yeah. What about like the cheese? Yeah, I'm going to shred it. This cheddar ball? You know how to do that, right? Uh, Okay. Cholula? No. What? Optional on top? In a taco salad? You'll see. It's like, it tastes like um, Taco Bell. I also think I want to test this again because I think I want to add diced tomatoes. We don't have tomatoes. Which uh, whole size should I use? I want to add tomatoes too. This one. Thank you, sous chef. Let's get our pot heaving up. We're going to make the beef. I don't usually measure my olive oil, but for the recipes, I do. And we're gonna do half a teaspoon. Pulls a little bit. Put that in, then I get my little notepad. So today is what? June 7th, 22. I just looked at the date and I forgot. Okay, taco salad. Yeah, I wanna add a few things in that she did not have in and like obviously make it my own. But we are gonna credit Debbie in the recipe website. If you didn't know, I went to my cousin's friend's party and his mom made this and I sat with her and talked with her about it. Um, so I'm gonna credit her in the description, but I do wanna make it obviously my own because we don't take other people's recipes, even though she doesn't have a recipe website. It's just her own recipe, but it's like a family recipe, you know? But I'm inspired, so I wanna create my own version of it. Salt, pepper, garlic, onion, cumin. I think I'm gonna keep it simple at that, to be honest. It's simple and easy to follow recipes that gotta be good, right? Right. Above. Thank you. El queso. Good job. Yo quiero el queso. 10 minutes, medium. Guys, when you make my recipes, make your own shredded cheese. Shred your own cheese, is what I meant to say. Make sure you shred your own cheese. Makes the biggest difference in the world. And I know I shouldn't be using a wooden spoon, but I already started, so just let me live my life right now, okay? This right here. Secret ingredient. I know this might be hurting your heart that I'm crushing them, but bear with me. Love my seasoning drawer. The bowl does not have to be aesthetically pleasing right now. Stop. Beef is gonna cool for a second while we assemble everything else. But it's a secret, I'm not telling you nothing. This recipe should be out though, two weeks after the launch date. Oh my God, is this bowl not big enough? A bigger bowl? Bigger bowl. Is this big enough? Yeah, what is that from? Is this bigger? That's from like SpongeBob or something. Bigger, bigger what? I don't know. You always come up with these random quotes. Oh, this is good. Hopefully when you guys got me. I can toss it. Maybe from a Disney movie? Or 
SpongeBob? I don't even remember what he says. Like, bigger shoe, bigger boo, bigger bowl. I don't know. <laughs> oh, you're sure you think of the racket. Okay, give me. I got it. You don't need no man. I don't need no man. Is it for the SpongeBob movie? Baby, I have no, I have no idea what you're talking bigger about. Bigger boo. I think that's what it is. Remember the guy, he stops on the thing in the, in the movie? Oh, yeah. And he's like, bigger. Yeah. I think that's what it is. This is definitely a how could it not be good recipe. This is a gotta be good recipe. Go I'm definitely gonna test this at least twice more before I film it. So, oh, this was rushed, but I'm gonna elicify this. And when you guys see it on the site, you're gonna be like, wow. I think that was the quickest I've ever cooked anything. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Wow, you guys get to see behind the scenes now. That's so fun. Take a seat, sir. Take a bite. Oh, but I gotta go. Where did you take a bite? I can't. Shut up. I'm legally black. Ugh. I'm gonna take a picture of the first draft and then see how far she goes. Sorry, Bella's on the chair, otherwise she I'd is. be sitting. Mm. Mm-hmm. Oh shit! Mm-hmm. Mm. -hmm. mm, -hmm. mm, -hmm. mm -hmm. All right, I ate this in the car, but it was phenomenal. Mm. Okay. That's a good first draft. I just sent a picture of Natalie. She's gonna be so proud. All right. My video's approved. The one that I just filled and sent in. Let's go. We love that. I was wanted to put Cholula on it, but I don't think it even needs it, to be honest. You know what you could do if you wanted it to be spicy? You just use like spicy nacho Doritos instead of the hot sauce. The chili Doritos. Maybe I should make it without with those. On yes, close the door. Bye. I love you. Okay, bye. I love you more. Have fun. Bye, vlog. Good bye vlog. He has to go teach tennis lessons. I need to decide what Doritos I want to use because I feel like the nacho cheese gives it that flavor. But also I love the purple chili Doritos. I mean, you could always just make the recipe and swap it out. But I will say I am a Cool Ranch Dorito gal. I am. Cheers to this. This is fun. I love having a recipe website. Well, I've decided to skip Zumba so that I can get my vlog up for you guys. And if that's not love, I don't know what is. Skipping Zumba, that's love, honestly. My class is 7 to 8 p.m. and I still have to finish editing it and make the thumbnail and upload it. So if I get back and do that, it's not gonna go up till late. And I just don't wanna put it up that late. We're currently picking a jingle for the podcast for before an ad starts. And I thought you guys would wanna be part of the fun. <laughs> That's more our vibe. Ooh, ooh, okay. <gasps> I like that. But obviously shorter. Sounds like a funk band. <laughs> you said think funky. <laughs> Wait, go to the one before that. That's cool, no? Like shorter? Uh, if I, shorter. We got, you know, we gotta get people excited for the ad, not like they're gonna fall asleep. Like, yeah, like that. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Yep. Like this. Perfect. Yep. Yeah. Tell me that's not better. Play the original one. Let the people hear. Uh, I don't have that any right now. <laughs> oh, <So>. yeah? <laughs> you picked it! What? You gave me six options, and that was the most well, decent one. Well, because I was going off a little blip sound that we had in there right now that we were okay, kind of place. If, I didn't know we were going to switch if to you, funky. Yeah, if you were going off the one that we previously had, then I understand. Yeah. But Agamel is like paint strokes, and like airbrush, and like graffiti vibe. You know what I mean? Like, fun. You gave me like a You gave me like a gotta be good Alyssa Rose vibe. We need Agamo. She is her own biatch. Biatch. That's cool. People are gonna be like, oh my god, I'm so excited for this ad right now. <laughs> They're gonna be like, is there a full song to that ad jingle? See, we just needed a little brainstorming sesh. Can you record me and go, get ready for the ad? <laughs> if you want. I'm just kidding. An ad's about to start. Please don't what? click off. Wait, you genuinely like it like this? Yeah. Yes. Wait, can you put can you put us poking like right before it? Oh, yeah. Good, 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 yeah. Mom gets the vibe. No, I just read that. Oh, okay. So my turn. Um, no, I this uh, is an old I episode. <laughs> yes! Cosine, mom? Cosine? Yeah. My turn. Please don't skip Am the I fucking turn? ad. <laughs> Please don't skip the fucking ad. We need to make money. <laughs> 
explosive like to the end. No. What Ooh. do you like in the original play? Ooh. Wait, what's the option? Say, 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 say one, two, B. three. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Listen, it's changing tone. Is that number three or is that, are we back to number one? You need to give me numbers. Okay, never mind. We're going to leave it. No, no, no. We want to no. pick one. No, no, no. Okay. We were it. ready. Oh, this one sounds best anyway. Maybe. Sir. What? Let us listen to the Sorry. options. One. Two. Three. Third. Third. <laughs> okay, like find the original. One. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I knew you were gonna say that one. Okay, much better. And then now you gotta go over to my computer, open it, and do the same thing, right? Make sure like the volume. Well, now it's gonna be a lot easier. Now I literally just replace the sound that I have in there with this sound. What's mommy doing? What is she doing? Like, you look over here, cute. <laughs> pretty kitty she sits right at the edge of the tv right and she picks up her tail with a paw and like cradles it and she like looks her tail it's actually That's so cute the so way she cute. does it like she literally like cradles her tail all right let's go back to so the cute. laptop migrating back oh gosh what a journey what a journey to get it <laughs> play it again play it again You're editing. Oh, this is so hard. And that would be rendered up until this ad part. He just took something off of the counter. Benji, what did you take? He literally stood up on the chair, listen, grabbed something with his paw. Oh, it's the cat to the ranch. That's talent. He did. He, like this. <laughs> like he grabbed it like a like, human. Like a, like a human. He walks around with the toys in his mouth, too, like a dog. Look at him. Get a bench. Get Get a bench. Get Get a bench. Oh, okay. The ranch is empty. I used a whole bottle on the towel <laughs> to cut it down. I think we need to have it. Okay, yeah, it's there. I love it. Me, me too. Bueno. Upgrades to the pod. Now I have a second to breathe since Gotta Be Good is out. <laughs> uh, of course. Uh, of course, we were playing with the toilet funny until I started recording. Uh, of course. Oh, whoa! I spoke too soon. <laughs> All right, everyone, it has been a long day. Can you tell? <laughs> it is now after 11, it's past my bedtime. Um, I did the podcast this morning and then I feel like all I did after that was stare at my computer screen. So I've had enough, <laughs> but we got a lot done today. We were very productive, I'm very happy. We got the podcast jingle, that was good. The vlog went up. We did good, we did good today. And Zane just did the dishes from dinner, so we're all clean. Uh, Amazing. I'm literally obsessed with my jewelry by the way. Like I can't stop staring at my bracelet. I'm hello focus on the bracelet not my big forehead. I Love it. Anyways, I ran out of the tanner. That's like super duper dark And so this one I'm just like mm, she needs another layer So I'm gonna go put another layer of tanner on to give me an extra glow tomorrow We have a little bit of a city day. I am going into the city with my friend Val She's a friend from the gym. That was loud. Sorry uh, She's my friend from the gym and she's coming to an event with me and we're gonna go to dinner before It's a boat event. It was rescheduled from last week if you guys remember so that'll be a lot of fun So I'm gonna take you guys along on that but for now, I'm gonna go tan and go to bed. Tomorrow's gonna be a fun day. I will see you guys. Hope you had a great, when is this going up? Saturday, whenever you're watching this. Today, it's Tuesday. Hope you had a great Tuesday. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow. I'm like so delirious, I'm so tired. Okay, bye. Good afternoon, everybody. It is Wednesday. Wednesday, Wednesday. happy Wednesday. All the days are blurring. Um, I didn't vlog at all today because I was just rushing around, um, but I filmed a TikTok of my, a TikTok? A TikTok of my current makeup routine, so that'll be up by the time you guys see this, so go check that out. That's what I was doing today. Um, what else did I do today? I had to get some work done for Gotta Be Good this morning. The train is really loud right now, but, uh, we're on the way to the city. I got my friend Val with me. Hi! We are 
are going to a boat event with Parlor. I'm excited, it got rescheduled from last week. So we are going to our dinner reservations right now and then we're gonna go on the boat and just have a nice night, have some cocktails and just hang out in the city. So I wanna show you my outfit of the day. It's the dress that I rented from New Leaf. I'm having some wardrobe issues though. It's a little big on me, I got a medium and I thought it would fit okay, but I guess not. Would you do the honors? Yes, ma'am. How am I looking? Phenomenal. Now, what? You don't go vertical on YouTube. How dare you? How dare you? Gorgeous. Um, I don't know where it's from, but I'll link it down below. But the strays are a little big, but I have a pin, so I'm gonna try to pin it. And then I put on converse because you know we wear a satin dress with converse. <laughs> Of discombobulated today because I was in a rush and now I feel like what's going on I don't have on the proper bra I'm actually not even wearing one I just have on nipple covers so we're just gonna we're just gonna go and pray that's what we're doing today <laughs> As we should. <laughs> Hello everyone, let me give you a little update. Dinner was absolutely delicious. It was chef's kiss, so good. Um, I keep getting hit on today, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> the waiter said I was beautiful. Um, what else happened? Oh, so two, if you, if you guys see a photo of me circulating the internet. <laughs> two high school boys that yeah. were like, we need a photo with this beauty. And they were like, can we take a pic? And I, was I was like, I guess. I was like, okay. I was like, sure. And then I was like, why did I do that? <laughs> but there's like a prom going on on one of the boats that are docking out of here. And so, I don't know, I was taking, Val was taking pictures of me. Volantu, she wants me to call her by her full name. <laughs> Volantu was taking pictures of me on the rock and he was like, I don't know, you were just taking pictures. So like, let's take pictures together. I was like, okay. <laughs> so if that picture gets out there on the internet, <laughs> it was two random high schoolers that asked me if they can with that. And then, oh, Jennifer from Parlor complimented my makeup. I was like, thank you. Wow, I'm really getting, my ego is getting fed today. I need to just tone it down. <laughs> um, but anyways, we're boarding the boat now. Everything's working out perfect timing. The weather is gorgeous. Very happy to be here. Oh, are we supposed to be going in there? Oh my God, that looks fun, Val. <gasps> Volantu. <laughs> Just forgot to say goodnight to you guys. I've got my retainer and I'm taking off my makeup. It was such a fun night. We had so much fun. We did our little Zumba dance. <laughs> it is now 1.25 in the morning. I am so tired. And I'm gonna go ahead and start a new vlog tomorrow. This place is a disaster. And we just got hell fresh that Benji's on top of. That's just a mood. Shout out again to Majuri for sponsoring this video. I'm literally obsessed. I was just telling my friend Val about it and she was like saying how she wanted to do jewelry. I was like, please try my jewelry, you'll love it. So go check it out. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all next time. Bye guys. Wow. <laughs> <laughs>
and then this is where you would go. So. When you don't have a tripod. <laughs> I love it, face is out. <laughs> yeah. You're putting your straw oh, I guess, in yeah. I like, we're actually, actually throw my gun out. I still have QT music over it, so they won't even know. There you go. They don't need to know. Nobody's gonna know. <laughs> yes. I didn't even put my straw in! <laughs> Part two, I'm part two. It, I'm losing it. I'm going to bloopers.